right, so five pieces of advice um, for anybody that's trying to do what we want to do, or what we do, <laughs> what I guess. What we want to do. Um, stay excited is one thing. Like, to never lose sight of the excitement you had when you first started your band, because I always see bands lose that excitement, and all of a sudden it's just kind of like an everyday, you know... It goes from it, it becomes a nine to five. Yeah, it's your job. Um, and then uh, another thing is that once you have your band, you know, try to brand it as much as possible. Try to make sure that you know people feel like they can relate to your band. Um, be honest. Um, to be honest with your fans is really important. People don't want to hear. People don't want to hear things that are just not true, and then they go see you do it or something like that. Or I don't know. Be very just personal. Be yeah, be yeah. personal. Just talk to people and stuff like that. Um, what else? Internet. The internet is your best friend. If you yes. stay at home, if you're just starting a band right now, like say like. Word of mouth is not enough. Word of mouth, yeah. You need to literally like. I mean, I used to think that the internet. Was, I hated Twitter. I hated yeah. Facebook. I hated all those you things. You need to make sure that you reach out to everybody, yeah. and then and even, even as far as even like, if you have twelve followers on Twitter, like they're very important. Yeah. And you need to make sure that, like, like playing local shows is enough. You need to get out. Like, you can only do so much on the internet. You need to get out. Like, when we were, well, I was younger, I used to think that, oh, record label will just call me mm -hmm. because I play. You need to prove to labels and you need to prove to, like, management and everybody, agents. That you have. That, um, um, yeah, you have to prove to them <laughs> that you're, that you have the potential and that you're a hard worker because <clears throat> nobody wants to work with anybody that's just kind of lazy and doesn't, you know, doesn't want to get up and, and do anything, so. Uh, <laughs> um, and be sure that I think another important thing is I think lastly is to make sure that you're working with people that you like like mm -hmm. work with your friends like even when it comes to management and labels like become friendly with these people get to know them don't just you're going to be living with them the majority of your life you know if this is what you plan on doing this touring all the time and if you don't get along with them if you're not friends if you're not you know, if you're just strictly co-workers, it's not. It's yeah. it's not worth it. It's not as fun. And you want to make sure you, it'll yeah. last. You want to be able to call your manager or your lawyer or anybody, anybody, and just be like, I got ripped last night and I got rug burn on my face, and they'll be <laughs> like, that was fucking awesome. So yeah, I guess just be friends with everybody, make it a personal thing, and don't take yourself like too seriously because yeah. that's how bands break up and. Just it's respect awkward. yourself and the people around you, and then that's about it. <laughs> you will win. <laughs> I hope we do. <laughs> I don't know.